Yo, yo, what up, man? Chris, somebody checking back in, man. Back with the blog, man. Make sure that like button, subscribe button, your way in. I appreciate all the support, man. You see the banner behind me, man. Your boy is finally back home, man. Finally back home. I've been out in L.A. You know what I'm saying? I was in L.A. Then I was in Utah. Then I went from Utah. I was in Nebraska, Omaha, Nebraska. Then in Omaha, Nebraska, I was in Chicago. Chicago, I was in Cincinnati, Ohio. And now I'm back in the A, man. Life of driving, man. Life of, of, of truck driving, truck business, the whole thing. I'm actually about to buy another Sprinter van. You know what I'm saying? I'm definitely about to do that soon. Um, probably within the next four months. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to try to find me a Sprinter van. But yeah, a few things I want to talk about, man. First thing I want to talk about, man. Easy to block Captain tweeted URL. Right here, man. Egos aside, call me. URL. Call that man. Definitely call that, man. I do feel like Easy and URL need to work out their issues and Easy needs to be back on URL. I know it's a lot. You know what I'm saying? A lot was done. He left URL. There was cease and desist. There was a lot of disrespect. There was a lot of FP, F this, URL this, Beasley this, Smack this, Remy this, Chrome this. There's a lot of that stuff. But I feel like at the end of the day, URL needs to repair a lot of relationships. And maybe if these niggas could get on the phone, you know, easier at first was talking about, oh, if I go back to URL, they got to pay me all this money. They got to do YouTube drops, all that kind of stuff. I don't think he on that type shit no more. I don't think he on that no more. I think he'll just go over there. And I think the rock battle is something URL needs to do. They do not really need to lose that battle to another league. They don't need to riot or somebody to come up with a bunch of money and try to put that battle together. So they need to pretty much get that battle and I think it, you know, I think from a PR standpoint, with everything URL dealt with last year, repairing relationships is where they need to be focusing on this year. And I think it, it's a good PR move to repair all the relationships, bro. I'm talking easy to block, Captain. I'm talking um, K Shine. I'm talking Mike P, Nun Nun, Ryder. Uh, who who else got some issues, man? It's, it's been a few people. I can't think of everybody, but. I'm trying to fix a lot of relationships and see if I can get people back on the platform. And I think from a PR standpoint, it's just good and easy. No matter what you want to say about easy, whether it is you fuck with him, you don't fuck with him, you like him, you don't like him. He's still a draw. He's still one of the top dudes in battle rap. The trenches is still doing a thing. So I like some of the competition that I'm seeing. And him and Tay Rock is still the biggest battle in battle rap that's legitly can be set up. I think that battle is actually bigger than Lux and Rum, to keep it real with you. I think Easy and Rock is bigger than Lux and Rum. And the only way you can go bigger than that, you might can go Daylight and Lux, but we know that's not going to happen. Maybe Hitman and Mook would be bigger, but that's not going to happen probably anytime soon. This battle right here could legitly happen if you kind of repair a lot of relationships. So if I'm looking at the landscape and I'm URL, that's what I'm doing. I'm getting, I'm bringing Big K over. I'm bringing A Ward over. I'm doing all of that stuff to fix a lot of these relationships, man. And I think that's what you need to do moving forward because you're starting to run out of matchups and you're starting to, to run out of, run out of just stuff that's going to reinvigorate the culture. And these are the kind of things. And once you get easy back over there, then you can get the twerk rematch because that's another big battle on that platform. So this right here, this tweet right here is an olive branch. URL, egos aside, call me. They called it with Beasley. They asked Beasley on the spot about a return of Easy. Tay Rock and Easy still a big battle, and Easy mentioned recently that you know he would still. See you going? No, it's a, it's a real. Look at you, man. It's, 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 it's a, you know. Going off the edge. I mean, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. I mean, that's something you know. I would have to get some thought to before answering. Okay, okay. You know what I'm saying? Because it was a random question I wasn't expecting for you to ask. So, you know what I mean? If you're asking if doors can be open, it, it it's. Because yeah, when you it, say so doors you... are being open, it's like a mutual thing. You know yes, what I'm saying? Yes, yes. I and mean, there's a certain certain things that have to be discussed you know what i'm saying so it's not an answer that i could just give to you offhand and say yes this is what's going to happen you know what yes. I mean? so. he didn't really commit to it but he didn't turn it down so at the end of the day he could have just killed it right in the middle of the interview he was like oh you know we got to talk we got to do this that lets me know you can probably at least get these two on the phone once you get on the phone, anything can happen. So definitely, I do feel like Easy needs to return. And it's not because there's no Chrome. There is a Chrome event. There's actually two Chrome events coming up. You know what I'm saying? I just found that out. There's two Chrome events coming up. Um, I don't know the size of them. I know one is big. I do know that. You know what I'm saying? One is big. And um, so it's not like Easy don't have no plates. So one is big. 
The other one, I'm not sure if it's a tournament. She was supposed to be doing a tournament. So I don't know if the second one is a tournament or something, but there are two Chrome events coming up. So I definitely want to um, say I do feel like that that should happen. The other thing, um, RBE, you know what I'm saying? They got the full circle joint. You got Aver versus uh, Ill Will. You got uh, Saga versus Young Ill. And you also have Charlie Clips versus Jag. And there may be another battle. There may be another battle. So it looks like, you know, ARP is kind of taking this whole thing where I don't really want to like really do big events or, or do cars like that really crazy. I'm not, I'm not really that interested in that. You know what I'm saying? I kind of just want to do spot dates and just do battles that I think are cool or whatever. And, um, to be real with you, I don't know how I completely feel about it. I like the matchups though. I'm not ever mad at a young ill battle. It's interesting to see him battle Saga. I wonder what he can bring to the table for Saga and vice versa. That's actually a dangerous battle because Saga is a lot better than people think he is. This is going to be pretty much a, a little lyrical war. And last time Saga was on the roof was B-Dot. And that's an incredible battle. Saga actually got one of the best battles in URL history with him and B-Dot on the roof. Um, as far as Charlie Clips and Jag, I think Clips will be much better considering what happened last time on the, on the full circle with QB. But this is my criticism of Full Circle, if I'm keeping it real. And I like ARP a lot. I'm kind of a person, man, where I try to give things a chance. You know what I'm saying? Full Circle, uh, straight to it, you know, where they do the battles and then you do the face-off after the battle. That was a concept ARP came up with. The three-on-three -three from URL, the gnome impact from URL. I'll give stuff a chance before I just knock it and say it's not cool. This is the problem with full circle. And I do I do like the concept. You go on the roof, you rap, you know what I'm saying? It's just two people in front of each other and all that. I realize as I watch them, if I'm being honest, I'm like, I like a little bit of a crowd. A little bit. It don't got to be much. Now, see, they got some people on the roof. But the way that the mic is set up or, or the way that it's being filmed, you're not picking up no audio from nobody out outside of that circle. So it kind of feels like there's nobody there. And I know, you know, we had the pandemic with URL and all this kind of stuff. And they were doing Daylight and, and Tay Rock and Mook and Tay Rock and all these, and Geechee and Averb, all these face-to-face -face battles. Mac, it happened. Rapping is your like favorite it. nigga. Figure how I tap it. Do you know what I happen yeah. if I chase a nigga? Uh -huh. You get the open hand, the fist or the deuce, rock, paper. Mm -hmm. Man, this nigga so soft, I could probably take rock, paper with some scissors. Clearly, I don't think they hear me. I said the nigga so soft, I could probably take rock, paper with scissors. Nigga, that's going to be hard to top. And you say, you the face of URL, they stamp you, Tay, K, cramp you, pay measly, Beasley, hands stuck in your pocket for profit with every trap you stay, smack you say, you hope he show up arm so you can get a cut. Oh, fuck. That explains why they amp you, Tay, rock with me. That's light. You right. I'm at you. Two deuce attached to, attack to, very scary. Terry hacks you. I ain't asked you. Y'all want to see a smack move, smack move. They say URL only fuck with gun bars. Is that true? Cock shoddy, rock body, it's statue on a ground man. Pound spraying, right with a man standing, K with the folding stock, big hole in rock. Welcome to the Grand Canyon. It's it was kind of like more accepting at that time because it was like, hey, it's the pandemic. You can't let people in. At least we can get what we, you know, at least we can get something. We appreciate you even trying to give us some battles during this, during this uh, pandemic or whatever. Now that that's over with, you start to look at these full circle battles and it's like, I like a little bit of a crowd, even if it's 10, 15 people on the, on the roof, at least giving you a, a slight cheer. Okay, cool. The other thing is when there's short rounds and the host isn't going to be there because ARP don't really come. So when it's short rounds, the minute you say a battle is two minutes or two thirty or what a two minutes with a 30 second grace. To a, to a battler in this era, I kind of feel like it says to them, like, okay, this is a cheaper battle. I don't have to go all out. I don't have to write my best. And I sometimes think they're programmed that way when you hear, like, one-rounders or short rounds. And then ARP isn't there. Now, I'm not sure where he would stand in the circle. He probably wouldn't be in a circle. But without him being there, I think it's an easier excuse for battlers to kind of, like, take it easy. And because we've seen, you know, Clip could have been better. Uh, Ill Will could have been better. You know, stuff like that. The last thing, the battles kind of lack a little intensity. It's like the way it's filmed because Avocado is in a circle. It's almost like 
the production is a little bit better than a battle. And it's like they play to the production. So if you look at like if you go back to like Mickey facts and you go back to verb, if you look at that battle, there's times when like Mickey is rapping here and verb is like over here. And Mickey isn't even really rapping to him and vice versa like that. It's almost like they're turning to like avocado in a circle and they're walking around in a circle to kind of like almost match the camera. Have an army. I have it on me. Ain't no hazard for me. Hey, Lizard, you'll lick a shot and find out it's a dragon on me. This Mickey. I'm on the Forbes B floor seats or the horse seat. Hey, nigga. My floor seats four feet from your seats, the front of my hood. Overseas symbols with horses. I come from the hood, where we come from the hood to enforce things. Percussion, snares tear like bears through a porch screen. They'll touch you and have your chest hanging on by guitar strings. You should stop, nigga. You're God gifted. This a lot different. I'm a killer. This shit ain't a gift that a god give you. Drum hanging out of that chop like a SWAT sticker. Then the slot lift up, hopping out like a SWAT stick up. Hey, listen, Mick and Verb, see what the fuss is about? You say my name, I bring that bread and come put blood in your mouth. I like the intensity of a one-on-one -on -one battle face to face. I like that. I like that verb and shotgun should like in your face. And nigga, you roll deep, nigga. What for? You get back door by niggas you let through the front door. Oh. Don't look. No gangs make no money, little nigga. They make wars. And niggas that y'all say stand up, they get floored. This is verb, Shug. Live from the set. I come from morals. If he ran off with a pack, then his debt becomes yours. Ah. With the strap, we put the stick on our shoulders and come forward. Knock it off, we box it out. But right after become boys, that's too real for you. You go to jail, they ain't still loyal. They're going to fill up on your bitch every night and I feel for you. you I, like, I like battles like that. And um, I feel like sometimes with, with the full circle, we haven't got that. So hopefully with this particular production and this rollout, you know what I'm saying? Ballers can look at stuff. I, Ill Will and Verb should be, niggas should be in their face. They didn't talk a little bit of shit. I want to see some barking in niggas' face. I want to see Young Ill and Saga you know, really be rapping to niggas and stuff like that. And uh, same with Charlie Clips and Jag. So I, I hope we get that at the end of the day. And um, I know they're trying to do a little bit more, maybe a pay-per-view, maybe some behind-the-scenes stuff. This should probably be a little bit better. But that's what's missing with the full circle. And ARP kind of needs to let people know that. Like, yo, like, turn, even though you're in a circle, kind of, like, turn up. A little bit, little, the only person that's been really, really kind of, like, like, kind of, like, amped up or whatever is Pain. He's the only one. He was, like, hungry in that circle. It's a little bit too, you know... I'm just rapping. It's not the intensity needs to turn up. That always makes for a good battle, even if it's not a beef. Uh, lastly, man, Lux is alive, man. You know what I'm saying? But RIP to his brother. His brother, for what I understood, passed away. And uh, you know, Sub Zero did some real disrespectful shit because he's pretty much the nigga that kind of started this. And you know, with the whole Lux is dead kind of video, and you know, Sub Zero and Lux was doing the whole Lions Den back in the day, and then you know, Smack came and took over the whole DVD game and the battles and everything. But the way he was disrespecting Lux and talking about Lux, and in terms of like not even having any tech or anything, you know what I'm saying? Like, like listen to some of this audio. This shit crazy, bro. Listen to some of this audio. Hold on, let me find. Like Smack and all the other guys took off, but me and Lux couldn't. Couldn't get along when the hold on. But me and Lux couldn't couldn't get along when the money came in. So people like Smack and all the other guys took off and we failed over nigga shit. Look at the way he talked. Me and Lux couldn't get along. You know, Smack came in and took over and we we failed in from nigga shit. He's saying this in the middle of a fucking Lux is dead blog. Look at the the bitterness and the hate in this nigga in this nigga heart, bro. This shit crazy. Nigga, nigga, go on and on. Like, look at this. Look at this shit. Hold on. Loaded Lux is dead, son. How? Oh, um, yeah. Loaded Lux is dead. Loaded Lux is dead, yo. I said that. I said that. Loaded Lux is dead, son. How? Oh, um, he took two bullets to the face. They shot about four or five New York niggas. Loaded Lux was one of them. First of all, I'm not even playing a video. I'm not even showing y'all the video. 
Bro, he looks like he's making it up. He's like, yo, you know, he took two to the face. And, uh, you know, they shot like five New York. It looks like he's thinking of what the fuck happened as he's doing it. And I'm just like, bro, who the fuck does a Loaded Lux is Dead video and actually is giving details to what? I would never say a nigga got shot in this. Yo, this is this is crazy. Loaded Lux is dead, yo. He dead, yo. It's like, bro, you almost happy the nigga dead. I'm sure when he found out that, his bro that it wasn't Lux, it was his brother, the nigga probably got mad. Like, you saying it wasn't Lux? You sure? You sh Are you sure it wasn't Lux? No, nah, son, I thought it would be Lux. You sure it ain't Lux? It's his brother? It's not Lux, though? Bro, this, yo, the crazy part, the nigga still got the video up. Mad niggas is telling him that fucking Lux is alive. The nigga still got the video up. This nigga is a certified corn billion, yo. He's a certified cornball. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And uh, clearly they got history in the past, but it's been many years ago since Lions Den, and these niggas are still... Got his issue, man. But that's it, man. Chris, I'm biased. Holla at your boy.